Don't take this keep going forever. may in fact close and close for good. Now we've taken up the case of the West Coast uh, community and the tourism industry of Tasmania and the Tasmanian government and we went to the federal government, to my colleagues the Prime Minister Julia Gillard and to Anthony Albanese, the Minister for Tourism and we made the case that if this railway closes it'll be very difficult to start it again. There are some 60 jobs directly involved with this railway, many, many businesses on the west coast of Tasmania, and also it's an iconic Tasmanian tourism experience. And today, I'm very pleased to announce that the federal government will fund up to $6 million to kick this rail back on track. not continue the operational side of the contract. Now we're asking all parties, including the federal group, uh, to continue uh, their contribution to and their interest in this wonderful enterprise. We will provide the capital costs for the upgrade, but we require others, including the state, to commit to funding to keep this sustainable. Have you said federal continuing to operate this, or definitely a new operator? Oh, I, I wouldn't comment. Again, uh, I think we need to look at the operational model that's going to best suit this enterprise and also, of course, make it sustainable. Now, I hope the federal group will play their part. I, I, I wouldn't understand why they couldn't. Uh, but at the same time, uh, we have a lot of expertise in this state and uh, we've got clever people and we need to sit down together and work it out. We're committing our funding on behalf of the taxpayers of Australia and Tasmania to, to the infrastructure upgrade but it needs an operational model as well as a commitment from the state government to continue to fund it. Thank you. If the news didn't come, what, what was it, Chris? Well, a, real, a really real risk that the railway would have closed and probably before April 30th. Um, so we we're really appreciative that um, uh, the federal government and through Sid were able to make this announcement today. So, I mean, obviously it's a, it's a sort of an earner itself, but a lot of a lot of businesses hang hang off an operation like this in a place like Queenstown or the West Coast, don't they? Exactly, it's an extremely important part of West Coast tourism. On the West Coast um, comes second only to mining, and um, it's an extremely important part, part of our industry. There was uh, 48, 50 full-time jobs involved in the, in, the, in the railway, and if you look at the flow on effect, it was upwards of 10 million dollars that we would have lost out of our economy. This is a turning point for the railway. Yep, it is. <laughs>